Hi, far more koi. I just thought um, today, it's Sunday, but uh, I just thought I'd do a, a, a beginning really to most of the vid I took yesterday. Yesterday I went to Perfect Aquatics to um, an event that uh, Anthony Day, or AKA Crafty, was um, holding. He's now manager there and he's trying to get people through the door. And uh, anyway, I went to the event and oh, what a wonderful day it was. <coughs> I chose my fish, my kahaku. I think I've got a super fish to be honest. See how it goes. But um, I'd just like to say a great big thank you to Anthony Day and all of his staff that were wonderful there that day. So a big, big shout out for Anthony Day and his uh, Koi channel, which is um, Crafty Koi. Wonderful, wonderful day. Can't, can't uh, fault it at all. It was a free lunch and uh, coffees and teas all day long. And um, the, the actual, um, place was uh, full of beautiful beautiful fish and every uh, kind of uh, dry goods foods pumps you know uvs filters you name it it was there if you wanted it it was there so i would highly recommend anybody that's into um aquatics generally really <clears throat> not just koi because there was a marine and uh, tropical section um, everything you could want so go visit great great place anyway I'll show you what I videoed and uh, you can see for yourself bye for now Off to a koi event today. Looking forward to it. Well, I've arrived. It's just gone 11.30 and I'm here. Far too early, but there's lots for me to see. With this big gorilla. One of our friendly YouTubers. What a nice fella. You present all these plants. Very nice. And I suspect this is the cafe and the entrance. Very nice feature. Yeah, this is the sea. These are fifty five pounds each, three for hundred and fifty. Ninety four ninety nine and three for two hundred and sixty.
drinks is very good. Very nice fish in there. 145. Beautiful. Price is in the book. I'm not surprised. Gorgeous. Outside pond. Beautiful. Kittens. The event fish, beautiful fish. Oh, love the way they're going round and round. <laughs> He's busy and he's going in. Not in the south, but in that. <laughs> Gonna have a bit more of a look around. But these look gorgeous. You should all be able to find something nice out of those. Thank <laughs> you. 
Inside, nets. Fittings. Just about everything you could wish for. This side, these are all the goldfish fats. Food. selection and stuff, feed up, Saki Hikari, it's everything here, just wish it was half an hour away and not an hour and a half away but even so an hour and a half drive it's uh, gonna be well worth it in the future I think treatments treats easy pods Nexus Beads. Changed this quite a lot since I had mine. As I say, mine's 17 years old. So it's been adapted with these overflows and whatnot. But the basic body is the same. Didn't realize how much smaller the 220 was. In fact, I can't believe mine's as big as that, but now it's, it's in a pit, so it looks smaller. Pumps. Air pumps. Everything you could or wish for.
is a beautiful pond of fish. But what else would it be? <laughs> beautiful. Easy pond after easy pond after easy pond. Tanks. <laughs> Can't go there anymore. My wife won't let me have a tank in the house, but... Uh, had a big marine tank at one time. But the porcupine puffer out all the other fish, so I gave up. <laughs> Poor advice, I think, from the shop that was. Clowns, love clowns. Tangs. Puffer. <laughs> He's a little blighter. Bought one about that big. He ended up, I don't know, 10 inches long or so and uh, yeah, everything in the tank. He used to surprise them when the lights was turned on or off. That looks like a big restoration project. sussing out the career they want to pick when it comes to their turn beforehand. It's going to be quite a game whether you get the one you want but anyway there's not a bad one in there. I am Beautiful. selling the parents and um, uh, his brother and her sister I will be selling. Absolutely so, gorgeous. Ladies, ones now. Okay. Um, and I don't expect he's going to turn around. She's going to turn around. And, oh, some yeah. don't. Come on. Have you got a phone on you? Uh, Lovely. I can get mine. They're beautiful. Yeah, you can do. That might yeah, be easier. They're beautiful. Because they are mean fishing in the fish. Yeah. The breed on there, yeah. Just go back and get them both in. <laughs> underestimated how much support this would get. Uh, originally from 550 pieces, we sold 80, so that is well over what I expected, so thank you very much for that. I want to just outline that the fish, just because uh, Rick thought that on the price that I'm giving them to you, 
that the, the, the authenticity of them was being undermined. Okay, I want to make it clear, guys, these are from Momotaro. They are from Momotaro. They are Jumbo Kogai, and the shop is making a loss. Right? I'm not bothered about the shop making a loss. What I'm bothered about is us lot, is putting people, getting together as a, as a group of people that we are, making new friends, right, and then using this shop that we've got, because we have got a vast shop, and it's going to get better every year, for you guys to come together and enjoy an event. That's what it's all about. The main thing is also to get people that have never been here into the shop, to have a look at the toy that we have got on sale because we are probably six to seven times their size so it really does give you an idea of what it is that we can cater for for every single one of you on the ticket i have put my business card please keep that with you and if you need anything going forward drop me an email and i'll do whatever i can do to service you as best i can if I can't deal with it, I will get somebody else that can. Mm. Now, funny bits or good bits. We are going to go on with uh, the Grow and Show. On your ticket, you have got a number on the back. Okay, your number corresponds to the name of the person that made the purchase. Okay, so what we're going to do, I've bought myself a nice little bingo sort of thing. Uh, I'll shout a number, and then all I need you to do is come to the front get three minutes to pick your fish. Once you pick your fish, go with your fish to the back where the measuring counters are, and then we will measure up your koi, record it, bag it, box it, and put your name on it. Okay? Go off and buy some more stuff. There are plenty more people in the store to help you. Okay? One thing that was pointed out is that I haven't taken pictures of all the koi that are in the event. Okay? reason for that is that it's a fun event right and everybody here i expect to just look at the toy that you buy measure it and then by the 31st of may you can then just email me over with your toy next to a measuring device so we can then see what the difference is in the growth okay if you want to cheat cheat all right don't bother me all you're doing is just, you're literally mapping over every single person here that has entered. All right, and it takes away from the whole thing that we're trying to do. So think twice if you're going to do it, please. On top of that, the prizes are for the first, for first prize in growth, non-heated, okay, you will get a free fish at the next event on top of multi Caesar, not multi balance Saki Atari. For a heated pond, biggest growth, again a free fish on the next event and a 15 kilogram bag of balance. For the YouTuber event, when your when your number is called, I would like you to associate yourself to one of the YouTubers, either GKD, Crafty Koi, which is me, <laughs> Lee Hadfield, and also Humber Koi. Okay, what will happen is then, when everybody sends in their results, I will work out the average growth of that team, and then that YouTuber will then enter the Hall of Fame of YouTubers, because they're very full of ego, and they love to be able to brag a lot, all right, but they will be in the Hall of Fame. They too will also get a free fish on the entry of the next uh, event that we do. Alan Tate has also agreed to uh, judge on photographs the best quality coin. Now, if you haven't seen it, Alan has already been down. He has looked at every single coin. He has got his own video references and he would also have a look at what you guys can produce. If you have got best growth, and if you have got uh, best size, you will get two free fish and two 50 uh, kilogram bags of balance. If you get the best quality without growth, you will get three fish and a 15 kg sake. 
bag. I think I've covered everything on that. Again, thank you very much ladies and gents for attending. If you haven't already done so, lunch is available in the cafe. They'll take the number down. Um, you can upgrade it to whatever it is if you want to go a little bit more and you obviously got your free teas and coffees. Has anyone got any questions? No, oh, thank you very much guys. Thank you. <laughs> No, that's the second one. Well, yeah, I think so. Yeah, really yeah. I've changed my mind yeah, quite a lot, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not confusing the issue. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah. Oh, yeah. Burning through with like the fight leather everywhere. Two elbows. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, that's what you had some fairly I'm going to struggle getting a, a flowery one out of this. Yeah, I agree. They're, they're uh, few and far between now. Been quite a popular one. So it's uh, about quarter to nine and I've just got back from um, Perfect Aquatics Crafty or Anthony Day's Grow and Show event and uh, with the fish so I'm just about to get it out of the box and float it for a while and then I'll get it um, settled in. So uh, I'll just uh, do that and I'll get back to you. So that's it. Um, I was number 32 or at least this fish is now going to become called number 32 and I don't know uh, what order I picked in um, I was pulled out quite, quite early but I'm not so sure I picked well or not to be quite honest but anyway I'll get this um, acclimatised and then I'll get it into a bowl and we'll have a quick look at it before I put it in so this is the fish that I chose From Perfect Aquatics um, event. Don't know whether it's a good choice or a bad choice, but well, it's not a bad choice. But uh, I felt under pressure, so I probably didn't choose as good as I had the opportunity to at an early picking stage. But anyway, I, you know, I quite like the Benny on the head and it's sort of between the two eyes and white nose and okay it's joined up with the second bit of any but then there's the, the third but there's Sirogi or white um, up towards the end of the tail tube and I think the, the body shape is nice the fins look nice so on the whole I'm happy. It measures uh, 30 cm and we'll just have to see how we go with it. It's a nice fish, but then they were all nice fish. But if you don't panic and you know what you're up to, there are some really good ones in there. But have I got any regrets? No, I haven't. No regrets. Really nice. So I'm going to sort it out to go into the um, toe side. I'm going to give it a very quick PP dip. And then uh, it's going to join its friends. 
there's two more Kahakus um, in their similar size now. So, yeah. See you all later. <laughs>